Welcome to another edition of IMO Sports with Pedro Justice. As you know, uh, welterweight champion Errol Spence was in a car accident earlier this morning. Well, I'm here to give you the latest update from different sources. They say that Errol Spence is in stable condition now and that his injuries are mainly from being thrown from the vehicle. So not having his seatbelt on is what saved his life. And so in the video you've seen so far, I showed an animation of a, a person being thrown from the vehicle. And so I feel that he was not thrown like so far up in the air and dropped down. He was more just kind of projected from the vehicle. So that definitely lessened the impact for him. And so it was more checking if there's internal bleeding, uh, checking his head if there's bleeding in the brain. And with his face being cut up from hitting the street, you don't know what's going on. He's probably knocked out or kind of out of it. So you have no idea if there's any broken bones or anything like that. But after reading the reports, they say there's no broken bones, no fractures, just scratched up and that he should make a full recovery. So I just wanted to update you because if you've been following what I've been posting all day, I've been on it. This is great news. It started off very scary for everybody. And now it's seem, seeming as though we have a better ending. And I'm glad that everyone continue to pray for Errol Spence as he recovers. Again, I never made this about boxing today. It was just about seeing a fighter that we all love and all care about in the boxing community that he was in a situation and we didn't know what was going on. And so as you watch the rest of this video, you'll see all of the love from the boxing community sent out to one Errol Spence Jr. Let me know what you think. Until next time, it's Pedro Justice.